hello friends welcome to another video on my youtube channel and in this video you will learn four different ways to do question and answer over a document and in this video i will guide you through all the required steps so that you can learn it very easily so let's get started since we are talking about question and answer let me show you the pdf document that we are going to use in this video it is the seven spiritual law of success by deepak chopra it is one of my favorite book there are other document types that are supported and i will show you how to use them as well in later part of the video next you must have open ai api key to access open ai functionality through langchain let's look into the code section i am here in my ipython notebook and i have created a virtual environment and installed this dependencies to run the cell in this uh, python notebook i highly suggest that you create a virtual environment and then install these dependencies so that it doesn't you know collide with the uh, global environment the first thing we are going to do is we will uh, load the .env file so that we can read this open ai api key so i will set open ai api key uh, to this package open ai so that we can use it anywhere now uh, let me load some imports first next we will create a loader a document loader uh, in my case i am using py pdf loader to load a pdf file so let me run that as well let me show you there are two types of loader supported by langchain uh, file loader and web loader so uh, there are like folders with multiple files csv file uh, docx json a pdf file text file different like 11 different kinds of file that are supported and from web loader there are different loaders available that you can load uh, into the document loader so i am using py pdf loader so let's see what is this loader you can see it's a long uh, lang chain document loader and pdf pdf loader at this location now let's look at the first way to do question answer over a document so for that i am using vector store index creator so let me import that i'll create index uh, which is uh, object of this class uh, vector store index creator and we will provide a uh, vector store class as doc array in memory search and we will load the uh, document into this index since we have this loader object so i'll do that this task can take time depending on the document size now let's see the index so you can see that it is vector store index wrapper now we can query the index and the query i am going to use is what are the seven spiritual law of success and we are going to use the same query throughout all the four possible ways of uh, question answer over a document and let me run this let's look at the response okay so the response is the seven spiritual law of success are all the laws it's a fairly kind of uh, accurate response so this is the first way you create vector store index uh, create a object of that class and then query over that index next let's look at the second way so for that i'm going to create documents which is uh, loader dot load so let look at the length of the document you can see 39 page and indeed uh, if we come here Uh, there are 39 pages 
Now let's look at the zeroth index of the document. You can see that these are the uh, text and metadata and page index. Now let me create embeddings. So I'll import Langchain embeddings, uh, open AI embeddings, and I'll create embeddings object. Here you can provide open AI API key as well. But since you, if you remember, we have uh, set uh, the open AI key to the dependency itself so that we don't have to provide it. But if you don't perform that step, you need to provide it here. Okay. Now, uh, what I'll do is that let me show you that if we have some text, okay, then we can create the embeddings out of that text and let's see the embeddings. Obviously, those are the number and let me just uh, copy this sentence because we are using this sentence throughout. Okay, here. Okay, let me do that very quickly. Yeah, you can see that uh, the numbers in the embeddings. So what we will do is that we will create uh, embeddings of the document we have. So we have this documents of 39 page and we will provide that document to this uh, doc array in memory search and from doc document and we will create a DB and then we will query the DB. So let me do that. So in order to create the embeddings for document uh, question answer, we are using this open AI embeddings. Now uh, our DB is created. Let's look at the DB. Yeah, it is vector store doc array in memory. Now this is the query. Now uh, the similarity search is done and let's see the documents first. So now these are the documents that are, uh, you know, found during the similarity search. And let's see the length as it is four. Okay. Now let's see the, you know, just, you know, you can visualize one of the documents. So this is the document and you can see that, uh, yeah. These are the things we found during this similarity search. Now uh, let's create a large language model and uh, let's create a query document, which is, you know, joining all the text uh, that we have got uh, from the documents. And uh, what I'll do is that I'll say LLM and then call as LLM and I'll format a string, uh, which is our query doc followed by, uh, you know, our question. And for uh, simplicity, let's also look at the query docs. So this is the whole string uh, generated from the uh, from this similarity search. Now, let me call this. Okay, let me run the cell. And let's look at the response. I think it will take some time because we have uh, so long text. Yeah, it, it is taking you, you know, more than I thought of. It will take around 24 seconds. Yeah, 25. And it doesn't have any sign to, you know, show the response. Uh, let's wait. Yeah, it took around 48 seconds. And now uh, let me print the response. So this is the response. Okay. And it looks very clean. And oh, I think, uh, yeah, I think this is the only response we have got. But you know, it, it doesn't uh, uh, have any prior text like these are the following seven spiritual law but it it's it's more better 
because each law is explained uh, in few sentence like two or three sentence as you can see here so yeah this is the second third uh, sorry second way again let me show it to you so uh, what we will do is we will create documents and then from that document we will create a db which uh, is again documents and embeddings embeddings is uh, open ai embeddings then uh, we pass the query we got documents which uh, are you know which are the documents uh, that have a potential answer to this query then what we'll do is that we will create llm and we will create a query doc and uh, with the help of llm we pass the query doc and our question and retrieve the question uh, retrieve the answer uh, next let's look at the third way so we have the db uh, we will use that db as retriever so let me run that and yeah let's see the retriever so retriever will be a vector uh, store retriever and it is obviously in memory now uh, there is retrieval qa chain and we will use uh, from chain type i will provide our llm so i think yeah this was our llm and uh, we will provide retrieval as our this db as retriever and let's say verbose is true and we will create a stuff qa chain now uh, this is our query and we can you know uh, uh, run over the query you can see entering a new retrieval chain i think it will take time as well yeah you can see uh, we finished uh, the chain and let's see the answer as well you can see that it is a fairly good answer now uh, so this is this is the third way where you have a retriever uh, and then you can have a retrieval qa chain and then you just run through the uh, chain whatever query you have uh, next uh, there is you know small extension to the first way so what we will do is that we will create an index and we will provide our embeddings which is our open ai embeddings and we'll say from loader so let me run this and this is the index so in the first way we haven't provided uh, embeddings now you know we can query to the index and get the response so uh, what are the seven spiritual law of success is our query and let's yeah let's see the response as well yeah you can see the response is you know fairly accurate so uh, i guess you have learned uh, four ways one you create index and uh, directly query the index like this okay uh, then you create documents uh, get the query document by you know first finding the similarity and then joining the text of the similarity and then again uh, calling uh, llm and pass the query doc to get the response the third is to uh, have your db as a retriever and create a qa chain and then query to the qa chain and the last one fourth one is to use the index while providing the embeddings to create embeddings which is kind of a faster way but out of these four ways i think you know uh, this retrieval qa chain is the best way to go with but you know i'll i'll leave that to your uh, preference and your requirements because you know it is it is not possible to explain all the different scenarios and things uh, this uh, this all for matter carries so i guess uh, this is it from my part of the video 
and i hope you have gained some knowledge uh, through this video in case you do so please consider subscribing to my channel that helps uh, thank you for watching peace